Well, demand for beef has continued to be strong both domestically and as an export item. And that demand didn't happen by accident. The beef industry has worked diligently for the last few years to improve its quality and consistency. Shell Winkley has more in this week's From the Ground Up. For a couple decades now, the industry has pushed a higher quality, more consistent product. That's what consumers want. And we measure quality not in terms of you know good or bad or anything like that. I mean, everything meets the same food safety guidelines, right? We measure quality. The USDA's quality grades are prime, choice, and select. David Anderson is a professor and Texas A&M AgriLife Extension economist and says beef grades are determined by one simple thing. And it's all based on marbling basically, the intermuscular fat, the fat that carries a lot of juiciness and flavor and tenderness and all that good stuff. And so when we go to a fancy steak place, you know, prime, we, you know, we got an idea what prime is. We got a decent idea what choice is. So choice is the middle one. Uh, select is the lower one. The only difference really is how much intermuscular fat is in it. If you go back a few years, about 2% of what the beef industry produced graded prime. Anderson says that the industry is trending towards producing more high quality grade beef. At the end of 2018, we actually had a couple of weeks where we produced about 11% of the beef produced in the U.S. that was graded was prime. But for the most part, we've been in the 8, 9% prime. Roughly 72, 73% has been grading choice. So select has been that 17, 18% roughly. Uh, but a shrinking share over time as more of the cattle we select on the ranch, the beef we're trying to produce fits a higher and higher grade as well. So, so you know, that you see prime beef at the grocery store, uh, there's a reason. That's because we're producing a bunch more of it. And consumers like it. I'm Shell Winkley, looking at Central Texas agriculture from the ground up. From the Ground Up is sponsored by Producers Cooperative, proudly serving agriculture since 1943.